Easy. We're lap two. One of the, like the most greatest rappers that was ever to bless the mic. And I can tell you how I can re relate to that line because this one Sunday in church, after reciting the Apostles' Creed, I took my seat and accidentally sneezed. This man walked right up to me. He said, "Excuse me, sir, but you've got to leave." And I said, "Why? Because I simply sneezed." Why can't you just say God bless you to me? He said, I can't say that because God hates fags. They all go to hell. Well, God did make Adam and Eve, not Adam and Steve, but also remember that he created plagues and disease and turned around and created me who just so happened to come in contact with HIV. But I didn't see HIV, so how in this big old world did it get a little old me? I mean, I was always high, but never jet lagged, and I need to always keep a condom in at least one of my bags. So I get this because indeed I am a bag. This is A. You know, the gay man's disease, but child, you'd be surprised to know that I got this from a married man with a wife and house keys. Oh, His yeah. wife, she was a beautiful <laughs> woman, but always kind of shy, and that's only because she didn't want you to clock her black eye. Which is why she's in MAC cosmetics to hide the choke grips, busted lips, plus the MK watch to cover the wristlets. She got the ring when she was only supposed to be a fling and shit. To her, this was a normal thing. I mean, she grew up watching her daddy with her mama ass, but one day she snapped, got mad, and stabbed his ass in the back with a broken glass. How could you love a man that only talks with his hands? Is this all a part of God's plan? How could she fall in love with a gunman? I mean, his mama told him he wasn't shit just like his daddy, and sadly, she said it so much, so one day he grew up and it finally came true. Child, that little dude was so quick, he knew what to do when he saw the red, white, and blue. Stash box full of keys, tuck the ski, pull up the sag and true religion jeans. And one day shit got so deep he asked the faggot to toss the gun that his hand squeezed. And I wonder if that's the same gun that killed half my classmates. Alexis, Pierre, Andrew, D. Hill, Keon, Izzy, and Malik, R.I.P. The ultimate death is silence, so let's talk about it. Then I just touch base on shit, HIV, gun, and domestic violence. Let's shake the table without causing one of them Ferguson or Baltimore riots. Come to a support group, but how can I invite you to a support group when you don't even support our troops? And I'm not talking about the soldiers in the streets throwing up their L's, they H's, they B's, or they C's. I'm talking about the soldiers overseas finding different diocese for you and me. And what if that was me that got choked up by the police and said, I can't breathe. Would you do truth and remember something, you know, the faggot ass white boy that just so happened to catch HIV? I'm just a human, right? It shouldn't be about who's black and who's white, because shit, we all human, right? It should be about what's wrong and what's right, punishing the wrong and rewarding the right. Now, that is how you honor a human's right. But back to this dude that had a wife and ended my life, so he thought. So one day, that weak ass bitch finally stood up and thought, you know this bitch called me? She said, hello, and this Mike? I said, yeah, bitch, this me. She said, well, I heard you had HIV. I said, well, bitch, you too, but you ain't get it from me. And she said, <laughs> and she said I thought about it, and I prayed about it, so let's talk about it. I can take you to a doctor that treats me, and I couldn't believe that she wanted to save me because shit, I didn't even save myself because trust me, y'all, if I did, I would have protected myself. But I'm here today to save you like she did me because guess what? I beat AIDS and so did she. And now we just waiting on a cure for HIV, and today it starts with you and me. My name is Mike with a mic, and the only thing I want you to know is your status and not just mine. Thank you. <laughs>